Hey guys, Nocturne here. Been a little while since you guys had anything from me, so I figured it was probably a good time to not only get something to you, but kind of give you a little bit of a channel update. And I figured, since we decided that Minecraft was such a wonderful place for me to be doing little, an almost vlog-like things, that I'd go ahead and bring you guys on a short little tour of the, well, what used to be the FTB server. Um, is now just the modded server, because we've expanded a little bit beyond what they had available for us. And hello, phone. <laughs> so, uh, I'm not going to be doing a full server tour. That would probably take three or four hours, and I'm going to try and keep this one under about 15 minutes, just because I want to have a nice little backdrop for while I talk to you guys. So, we are currently in my Mistcraft age, and I figured I'll just kind of walk and talk. So first and foremost, I probably haven't uploaded a video in, oh, at least a month since, mm, since around Christmas, actually, and for that, I do apologize. Things have come up, uh, starting back at work after the, the holidays, getting kind of sucked into all these mods, uh, adminning the server, which takes a lot more time than you guys would imagine, and... Yeah, things just have been getting in the way. Life things. But, I am back recording now, and I figured I would let you guys know what my plans are going forward. So, for the moment, I'm just gonna show you things to confuse you, <laughs> if you have no idea about any of these mods. Uh, so, first and foremost, I guess let's start with Final Fantasy XIII. I do have every intention of finishing that game, and I really am excited to go ahead and finish it because we're getting really close, and we just got to my favorite chapter, and I feel really bad about <laughs> just kind of stopping out of the blue like that. So we will definitely be getting back to that. The only issue comes with the next LP to talk about, which is Borderlands 2. I know that it hasn't been the most popular LP that... Not as many of you have been getting excited about it. However, the reason we haven't been getting so many of those out lately is been mostly scheduling issues. Uh, Ninja, Avi, Borth, and I have been definitely enjoying the game and playing it a lot. Or, we're playing it a lot. But in the last two months, we really haven't had a chance to get together. Uh, people have been busy on Saturday, and things have not come together, put it simply. So we haven't gotten a whole lot accomplished, although while we were playing, we did get a very large backlog of recorded videos, something like, I want to say, 10 or 11 hours. And that brings me back to the Final Fantasy XIII LP, why it hasn't been out so much. We ended up recording so much that, well, I filled up all my hard drives. And so there was literally no more space to record Final Fantasy XIII. And... So, you might be saying, or thinking to yourself, Nocturne, that sounds like a really easy problem to fix. Just edit the videos up, put them out, and hey, more space! And while you might be correct about that... Spooky voice. I have found myself somewhat unmotivated, let's say, to edit the Borderlands 2 videos. And a lot of that has to do with, well, <laughs> the popularity of it. When you spend so much time... I love some of these mods. Whee! When you spend so much time and effort on a series, and while I realize that there's only about 50 to 100 of you guys active on the channel anymore, and only five of you are watching the show, of which two or three are probably the guys I've been recording with, it's a tad depressing, a tad discouraging, and a hell of a motivation killer. And t to be quite honest, it's been hard to want to spend the time editing, rendering, cleaning up, and turning things into a really, really nice quality episode. Yeah, that's not a graphical error, guys. That's a giant hole I dug out. Not by hand. <laughs> so... Borderlands 2 has been a little difficult for me to want to work on, although, good news, 
I've decided that it's high time I cleared out my backlog of recorded footage and have been working on it. Uh, you should be able to expect some episodes from me probably a few days after this channel update goes out. So, the backlog should be cleared hopefully in another week or two, as I'm doing pretty good with that. Hopefully the Borderlands 2 videos can resume again. A little storage room down here. I'm rather impressed with it. You can see the little inner workings if we head back here. And so, what did I leave off on? Borderlands 2, yes. I believe we're finally going to be able to get around some of the scheduling conflicts and actually get back to recording. However, we might have a slight change. Uh, given how long it took us to record and actually get through the game, <laughs> Forth got a little impatient with us, and honestly, who can blame him? Who wants to take five months to beat a game? I know I don't, but hey, that's kind of part of the... kind of goes with the whole LP thing. Sometimes you don't have time to both play, edit, record, and all the other stuff that goes along with it. So, depending on how Borth feels, because he has already beaten the game without us, well, if he feels like playing with us, he is more than welcome, but if he's kind of bored with it, then we may no longer have him around. I'll let him answer that for you guys, though. And Final Fantasy XIII, once I clear out my hard drive of all this uh, backlog of footage, I am definitely excited to get back into that. Now, as far as... Uh, that's... Pretty much catches us up with current LPs. Now, as far as future plans go, my auto crafting system is awesome. And I love, even though this is the unofficial version, some of the changes he's done. And yes, for those of you who know these mods, yes, I auto crafted that. <laughs> So, future plans. Now, I'm semi-hesitant to go into this one, because I'm not entirely sure if I've set my mind on it yet, but with as much fun as I've been having playing on this server, playing with all the guys who have been on the server, and just getting to know all these mods, and finding out just how much of Minecraft is still awesome once you've got all the mods in place. I've been toying with the idea of, yes, coming back. Starting a, I guess we'd call it a new season. But it will definitely be modded Minecraft. And it will definitely be SMP. And it will be on this very server. Although, things are subject to change, and no guarantees can be made at this time, blah blah blah, legal speak, yada yada. Ooh, yeah, a factorization room. This took a long time to get set up correctly, but it's really kind of cool. Uh, now, as far as the server goes, and the... Hmm, how do I say this? I know in the past, I was inviting you guys to come join... All of us here on the server, if you were interested, and were able to prove that you're not a complete... Mm, how do we say this? Griefing butthead. Yeah, we'll go with that one. That's probably about as uh, polite as I can make it right now. Then we were bringing you guys onto the server, and as far as that goes, I do kind of apologize for not keeping up with the uh, PMs that you guys have been sending me on YouTube and Twitter. Uh, I kind of got behind on those, and it was long enough that... By the time I did get to them, none of you were replying to them, so if I didn't reply to yours, it's only because I assumed that it had gotten to that point where no one was going to be replying to them, so if you're still waiting on a reply from me, I do apologize. Uh, why don't you go ahead and send me another message letting me know you're interested. For the most part, what I'd like to see from people who are going to want to join the server, that you kind of know how to play in a community. That you realize... You're not the only one in the game, and things that you do affect others. And for those of you who are on the server already, you kind of have a pretty good idea of what I'm talking about. And like I said, the, the biggest thing is we don't want griefers, we don't want thieves, we don't want people who are going to add chaos 
At least, not too much. Some prank wars have been going on off and on, but not a whole lot. If and when we, I do start the SMPLP, um, as far as anyone who's on the server now, as in right now, as of this moment when I'm recording, you guys are more than welcome to stay. There is actually... Oh, thanks, little dude. I'm making a mess, and you're picking it up for me. You are so awesome. <laughs> going on, going forward, what I think I'd like to do is pretty much kind of how I laid things out way back at the end of Season 1 of my vanilla LP. And anyone who joins the server, I'd like it... I'd like to have you guys actually do recording yourself, do your own LPs on the server. And why, you may ask? Quite simply, exposure. How? How so? What do you mean, Nocturne? Quite simply, I think the more of us putting out videos from the server, the greater all of us will have a chance of getting our videos collectively viewed from the masses of YouTube, who can be quite fickle, as you all know quite well. So, that is something I'd like to see, is that we strictly limit newcomers to LPers, or people willing to try LPing. You don't have to have been an LPer in the past, but if you're willing to give it a try and you want to join the server, then I would love to figure out how we're going to handle that once we get to that point, which will probably be at least a month away as of the time I release this video, and you're hearing me right now. So, I think that is probably the biggest announcement I have right now for future plans. Uh, as far as e good ways to be considered in the future when I do finally figure out how it is we're going to select who joins the server, best things to do is get involved with those of us on the server, the little community, small though it may be, that we've got going on here, and join in. We've got an IRC channel and would love to have more people around chatting with us, talking about what you're doing, what you got planning, things you want to do. I don't know. What's going on with you, what you're doing in Minecraft, what you're doing in any games. Just come and hang out with us. Be a good way for us to get to know you and know whether or not you would make a great addition to the server kind of thing. Just simple little things. And let's see. Other future plans, I think that most of you have, who are following me on Twitter have noticed that I've been retweeting a lot of antechamber stuff recently, and that is definitely something I am looking forward to playing, and will, would like to get to LPing at some point in the future. So, other future plans, I would like to actually get around to Portal 2 at some point, and Portal, for that matter. And I know in the past that when I had mentioned Portal 2, uh, one person in particular had pretty much volunteered right away to do the co-op with me, and I think if he is still interested, talking to you, RTL Shadow, if you're still out there and interested, I would love to bring you on for the co-op once I finish the single-player version of Portal 2 and Portal 1. And if you're no longer out there and no longer interested, then I'm pretty sure Avi has voiced interest, and we'll go ahead and LP that together, if we can yank him away from what he's playing right now, which... <clears throat> never mind. <laughs> and wrapping things up here, I think the only other thing I had written down, as you guys know I like to keep notes, Final Fantasy XIII 2. I'm still kind of unsure about it. Uh, current thinking is that I would sort of do the play some, record some, play some, record some. So basically I would be playing ahead, and then when I record, I do it very walkthrough style. And so I hope you guys are looking forward to, would look forward to that, and are looking forward to a lot of what I've got going on. I know I've been very silent lately from all sorts of angles, uh, in regards to YouTube and LPing, and I've been pretty bad at responding to comments too lately, although for the most part they've only been showing up on the old Season 1 Minecraft LP. So if you guys have been hoping for a response on that, I apologize, but a lot of them refer to game mechanics that exist now that didn't exist back then, and I don't want to keep telling people that's an awesome idea but didn't exist back then, so forgive me if I haven't responded to your comments. And I think we're kind of hitting that 20-minute mark by now, so I'm going to go ahead and wrap things up here. 
Uh, I'm going to try and edit this up, and hopefully I got everything said I wanted to. And if you guys have any questions or comments, please go ahead and leave them in the section below. I'd love to hear what, what you guys think. And as far as things going forward, as usual, if you guys like what you're seeing from me, tell your friends. Tell your family. Tell them to check it out. Point them to your favorite video of mine. Maybe we can get some more people around here. Because I know I would love that, and so would the others. And as far as touring the rest of the server, if you guys kind of enjoyed this, I could probably go and do an actual tour video later, and maybe explain a bit more of what I've got going on here. I just kind of did a quick run-through. And maybe I can actually tour some of the other people's ages, because they've got some really amazing stuff. And, I mean, if you see Black Flames, Thaumacraft, Thaum, Thaum, <laughs> Thaumcraft Tower, or Merrick's Flying Airship, you guys will be blown away. So... Uh, this seems like a really good time to finally stop talking and say goodbye. This has been Nocturne. Thanks for listening, and I will see you guys again real soon.